Well, folks, welcome to another episode of Exploration. I'm your host, Randy Bowser. Hey, we're going to do something really fun today. We're going to do what I'm, what I'm going to call pier pouncing. You know, I get a lot of questions from folks visiting the area on what it's like to fish from the piers. And you know, we have numerous piers from Telcheck all the way down to Chubernau. Today, we're going to visit three of them. We're going to start right here where I am right now in Ch uh, Chicxulub. And then we're going to move to Progresso and then on to Chubernau. So you all stay tuned. We're fixing to go fishing. Well, I tell you what, it's a little chilly out here this morning. It's uh, December 29th, almost to the end of the year, getting rid of this year, 2020, 2021 coming at us. Hopefully it's a good year for everybody. But I tell you what, we're gonna start right here. I've got three rods. I've got my Yozerti, my DOA, and a hook ready for my shrimp. I always like to bring out three different lures when all else fails the shrimp will work so let's see if we can catch some i'm going to throw first the yozerti and see if we have any luck with the crankbait then i'll throw the doa and then we'll resort to the shrimp So as you can see, I have a really small little hook, little piece of shrimp, little weight, take it down to the bottom. Pier fishing, you really want to kind of downsize that hook because there's just not a lot of big fish that you're going to catch with a bigger hook. You can catch a bunch of pan-sized fish. That's good for ceviche, pan frying. I've got them tinking all over. They keep taking my, my shrimp. Well, there we go. Got this little catfish. So that's a little blowfish so far, a little catfish. Come here, buddy, I don't want you to stick me. No sticking me today. Alright, look like I'm gonna be catching catfish all day. <laughs> be prepared to catch some big fish from the piers, y'all. <laughs> a little grunt. Well. Little globos, little blowfish. <laughs> I have to say in my lifetime, that is the smallest little catfish I have ever caught. Check out that little baby catfish. All right, well that's gonna wrap up the Chicxulub portion. We've now made our way here to Progresso. We're at the Chocolate Pier. We're gonna do the same thing. We'll take our three rods out there. Most likely it'll be the shrimp that is going to be catching the fish but as you see we caught a couple of catfish some blowfish some little tiny ones i swear that was the smallest little tiny catfish i've ever caught in my entire life so folks we're gonna step out here and we're gonna see if we can catch some fish from the progresso pier stay tuned Chubernaw at pier number three just finished up progresso and well you know it's just nothing to write home about but i tell you what it's still fun you kill time caught some small fish caught some blowfish i have in the past caught some pretty good fish decent sized fish to make ceviche out of from the progresso pier so 
Let's take our shrimp out here to the Chubernaw Pier and let's see if we can go catch some more fishes. Y'all stay tuned. Well, folks, thanks for joining me for this episode of Explore Rishing Pier Pouncing. That was kind of fun. We visited three piers today, Chicxulub, Progresso, and Chubernaw. As you can see, the fishing is fun. It's not exciting. It's nothing to write home about. But you can go out there. You can take the family. You can catch some fish. You can have a great time. I started at 8 o'clock this morning. It's now 2 o'clock. So I was able to kill a whole day visiting all three of those piers. And, you know, I had a ball. So I would say the best of all of them today was Progresso with the variety, even though they were small. I caught that one big uh, Rubia here in Chubernaw, plus a few more catfish. So all in all, I was pleased. So listen, y'all stay safe, stay healthy, stay tuned, and we'll see you next time here on Exploration. Adios.